John Hagens said nothing as he stood alongside his appointed public defender. His case heard alone. Only those associated with him allowed in the courtroom, presumably family, and they had no comment. I want to go ahead and find probable cause. Said bond is none on all three counts. Appointed public defender. Police say other students, friends of Hagens, alerted them to alarming statements Hagens was allegedly making about purchasing a gun to shoot up the school. They say Hagens shared these pictures with them on Snapchat after he reportedly sold his truck to buy a collapsible rifle that could fit into a backpack and hundreds of rounds of ammunition. Police say in the chats, Hagens wrote, I finished my back to school shopping and that he was loading his bag for tomorrow. Police believe the shooting was to play out yesterday, Thursday, the last day before winter break, when the campus would be packed for finals. Hagens had also allegedly told the student witnesses he would purchase a silencer so he would be able to shoot inside the school library. He was headed over to Volusia Top Gun for practice and then he was headed to Embry-Riddle. With the witness information, police believe they averted tragedy. Surrounding suspect Hagen's apartment complex, detaining him as he came out, an arsenal in his backpack. Friends say Hagen's, who was on academic probation, started to struggle in school last year after being accused of sexually assaulting someone at a university party. Police are now actively investigating that as well. Hagen's will be held no bond at least through next week. We're at a hearing. Prosecutors are expected to argue for ongoing pretrial detention due to the nature of the alleged crimes. In Volusia County, Claire Metz, WESH 2 News.